Pancreatic Cancer Introduction Pancreatic cancer is the fifth leading cause of cancer deaths in the U.S. About 29,000 new cases of pancreatic cancer are diagnosed each year in the United States. Cancer of the pancreas is a disease that affects the pancreas and sometimes surrounding organs in the abdomen. It is occasionally curable if found early. This patient education lesson will help you understand what pancreatic cancer is and how you can reduce your chances of getting it. Pancreatic cancer. Pancreatic cancer is more common in men than women. People who smoke and eat high-fat diets are at a higher risk of developing pancreatic cancer. People who develop sugar diabetes in their 50s and do not have a family history of diabetes must be checked for pancreatic cancer. Most pancreatic cancer begins in the ducts that carry digestive juices. A rare type of pancreatic cancer can begin in the cells that produce insulin and other hormones. These cells are called islet cells, and the cancer is called islet cell cancer. As pancreatic cancer grows, the cancer cells invade other tissues surrounding the pancreas, such as the stomach and small intestine. This is called metastasis. When pancreatic cancer metastasizes or invades other areas of the body, it tends to go to the lymph nodes of the abdomen and to the liver. Sometimes it also goes to the lungs and bones. Signs and symptoms. Unfortunately, pancreatic cancer tends to have very few early symptoms. As it grows, it can cause major abdominal and back pain. If a tumor is located close to the common bile duct, the duct can become blocked. When the bile duct is blocked, bile can get backed up. Bile is a yellow substance that is secreted by the liver. If bile gets backed up, the skin will turn a yellow color. This is called jaundice. The urine also becomes darker since there is more bile product in it. The stools become chalky white because they do not contain any yellow bile. When bile gets backed up, the body may feel itchy all over. Diagnosis.